All right, so the next thing we're going to do is, um, uh, shoot, I blanked out. Just keep going. I'll, I'll, I'll cut it out. Is it, go is it still going? Um, so the next exercise that we're going to do is uh, more of a stabilization exercise uh, to really keep your abdominals and your lumbar spine in a really good neutral position um, with hip flexion. So we're going to work again, kind of like the lower portion of your rectus abdominis, uh, but we're going to get the, the transverse abdominis activated. Your obliques is going to pretty much get everything. So you're going to, um, we're going to start off with the easy version first, which is one leg down. Uh, so you're going to tighten up, you're going to really keep this nice and tight, push your obliques out. You got this tucked in and lift your legs. So you should feel your hip flexors kick in. You should feel your abdominals kick in. Um, but, uh, you want to just want to make sure that there's really no pelvic movement. That's the big thing. So watching your pelvic bones, that there's not too much shifting going on. If you want to progress it, uh, you could have both legs down like that, tighten up, get the obliques on and one leg at a time, just like that. Again, watching that these bones are not moving. Uh, and if you're really, you're really stable, you can try for a double, but uh, not too many people are doing that. There are other variations. You can kind of have one leg up like that and one leg down, um, one leg suspended while you're uh, leg raising. But again, the only way you're gonna move on to the next exercise is if you could uh, complete the other one with good stability, your pelvis is nice and stable.